this had a problem that was asked yesterday in the UPSC preliminary examination paper 2. Although paper 2 is the qualifying paper, but the importance of this part cannot be neglected. Let us see the first question, t to the power 2019, when divided by 10, what is the remainder? Remainder, we have to find the remainder here. When we see this type of question, it looks so much like it looks lengthy or it looks a bit tough. But in reality, these are the, some, these are uh, an easy question which is very common in case of uh, bank exam, SSC exam and uh, state, uh, state government jobs exam. So, <clears throat> I'm going to explain uh, in a very easy way. 3 congruent to 3 mod 10. Don't be scared. This is an easy one. Why, the reason why I'm writing 3 congruent to 3 mod 10 is that 10 can divide 3 minus 3. 3 congruent to 3 mod 10 means when A is congruent to B mod 10. A minus B congruent to 0 mod 10. Which means 10 can divide A minus B. Just like that. So we are raising the power of 3, 3 squared which is 9. Since 10 cannot divide 9, 9 is less than 10 still, no? So, 3 squared is 9. It is still congruent to the same number. So, the reason why I am writing is 9 congruent to 9 more 10, which means 10 can divide 9 minus 9. So we go on like this, we are raising the power to cube. When we are raising the power to cube, to cube, 3 cube is 27. 27 to be divisible by 10, we must subtract 7 from 27. That means 3 cube convert to 7 more 10. So, if we can write 2019 as a multiple of 3, that means 3 to the, to the power 2019 will convert to 7 or 10. Let's see whether it is divisible by 3 or not. 3. So, 3 to the power 2019 can be written as 3 to the power 3 to the power 673. So that means 2 square is divisible by 4, isn't it? And 4 will also still divide 2 square square, which is 16. Raising the power again, 4 will still divide this. That means when, four, when these things are divided by 4, it will leave no remainder. No? So, just like that, we are raising the power till 673 and the result or the remainder will still be the same. That means when 10 divides 3 to the power 2019, which is 3 to the power 3, to the power 673, the result will be same, the remainder will be same, so the remainder will be 7. And this is the next question, which is a big number 37981253369. P369. What will be the value of P when this number is divisible by 7? For the shortcut, let us divide this whole thing by 7. 
third is three seven nine eight one two five. So when we divide this whole thing by 7, it gives the remainder true. That means, it gives the remainder true. That means, true P369 to be divisible by 7. What will be the value of P? That is the same question, we are reducing it to a smaller number. So, let us write true P369. What will be the value of P? for this number to be divisible by 7 let us this from 1 2, 1, 3, 6, 9 will it be divisible by 7? 7, 3 is a 21 7, 5 is a 5, 5 19 remainder which is not divisible by 7 so we can eliminate 1 next true P369 means true 6, 3, 6, 9. Will it be divisible by 7? Let us see. 7, 3 is a 21. Remainder 53. 53, 7, 7 is a 49. Remainder 46. 7, 6 is a 42. Remainder 4, 9 which is 7, 7 is 49. That means the value of P must be 6. This will be the answer.